Hey guys, Zero here with another single shout out. Uh, we're, uh, the sub series of Zero's album review where I talk about a single I've listened to recently. Um, and today we're going to talk about the new single from Enter Shikari, The Dreamer's Hotel. Um, now, if you don't know, a new Enter Shikari album is coming out on April 17th, 2020, called Nothing is True and Everything is Possible. Uh, they recently released a new single. It came out, I think, in f on February 10th. Uh, so it's been out for just over a week. Uh, I've been listening to it on and off. I found out about this because of my friend uh, Excalibur, Enter Excalibur. He's Enter Shikari's favorite band, so of course I have. And uh, I do have another video with him going up about one of Enter Shikari's albums later on so definitely check that out when it comes out um but let's talk about dreamers hotel um first off this is uh the from what i understand the goal of this album is enter shikari wants to take everything they've ever done like all the genres and mixing and stuff together and put it in one album so this one's supposed to have a mix of everything for everybody now if you don't know about enter shikari they um <clears throat> they've always been big on experimenting especially with electronica stuff their <clears throat> first album uh, Take This Guys, um, which is my favorite album of theirs, uh, is more of a metalcore album, uh, but it has a lot of electronica stuff. And if you've listened to metalcore bands like Under Oath, uh, Attack Attack, stuff like that, you know what to expect for on the electronica side. Though these guys aren't as crab, aren't crabcore at all, like Attack Attack, but you get the idea if I explain it to you. Um, and uh, it's it's a solid album. They've uh, experimented more as time has gone on, and some of the albums I like and some of them I don't. I think my favorites are, um, like I said, Take This Guy's is my favorite, and my second favorite has to be The Mind Sweep, which is the one they released uh, a couple of years ago. Um, but yeah, this one, they're, apparently the focus is to take all the stuff they've uh, learned over the years and put it together in one album. And I can definitely hear that in the single for The, uh, the Dreamer's Hotel. Um, I like the way the song's aesthetic is. It has a good uh, electron, like, electronical bassy and beat but then there's still the hard uh guitars stuff that you would expect from metalcore and it it meshes together almost perfectly it's hard for me to like explain without you listening to the track but it just meshes together perfectly uh, a couple of other things i love about this uh track is if you watch the youtube video they have like a <clears throat> just a a track video um where they have the lyrics down below uh what i like is they have this little border with the uh with uh color bars going by it kind of remind me of when you load a program from tape on a zx spectrum uh except instead of it going lines going up and down the screen they're kind of going side to side and every so often one of the yellow lines will come in and glitch on the screen going across um just a picture uh the main image is just a sculpture i don't know what i don't know what the statue is but i'm sure somebody in the comments will know and then there's like the glitchy of the same colors going across the mouth so um yeah just kind of little art thing i don't know if this is uh one going to be a political album like uh some of their other albums like uh common dreads but uh it uh it kind of feels like it might have a little bit of that influence um in terms of the song itself i really enjoy it it's one that i can't stop listening to on apple music uh so it's one that i've listened to a lot um and uh it, it makes me excited for the album um like i said i don't like every single under shikari album but i do like a good chunk of them and uh, this is a good solid uh single to start off with so it makes me uh very interested in the album when it comes out i've already got it pre-ordered on uh, apple music and if i like it enough i'll probably uh, purchase it digitally or physically when it gets a physical or digital release in that sense um so yeah if you like enter shikari if you like electronica if you like metalcore uh, if you like a mix mashing of genres, cornucopia of genres, as I've mentioned before, um, you'll probably like this one and it's definitely give it a listen. Uh, I think it's on Apple music and Spotify. So check it out. Uh, the track's not super long. It's, it's under three minutes. So if you don't like it, well, you only wasted three minutes of your life. So in any case, guys, thank you for watching, uh, this video. Uh, why don't you go ahead and leave a comment down below and some suggestions of songs or albums that you'd like me to listen to i've gotten a few suggestions and i'm going to be looking into those very soon um while you're at it uh maybe give this video a like share it around that'll really help me out uh if you want to see more videos like this definitely hit subscribe and then hit the bell to get notifications because i'll be posting more of these uh if you want to follow me on my social medias you can follow me at 
Zero Master fan page on Facebook. Uh, you follow me on Twitter, at Zero Master. Uh, if you want to support the show, get early access to these videos and get behind-the-scenes extras and so much more, patreon.com slash Zero Master is a good place to do so. And I do stream live on Twitch Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time on twitch.tv slash Zero Master, with the exception of February 25th, uh, Tuesday, February 25th, as I will be out of town going to see Refused in concert. So just a heads up to anybody going to my streams then. In any case, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Oh, my God.